hi guys this is gonna be a quick video i'm just gonna show you guys the new update that maxis has just released today july 9th 2015. so we'll go right into it i'm just gonna show you the new update the new items new interactions we can finally 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 lock doors so i'm super excited about that i went ahead and just put a mom dad and daughter into this lot here I created to show you the new items, so I'm going to show you the new outfits here for the let us give it pause. For the male, they have this new towel, which goes around the waist, which is super cute. There's also different colors. You can see there's a light blue, there's a baby blue. There's just different colors of the towel, and you can choose whichever color you'd like. For her, I put a pink towel here, and for the little girl, I also put one. It's so cute. So these are I'm going to say for the day spa pack, it's kind of to get you ready for it. They give you a little free item. The kids also have some new slippers. That's super cute. So we'll go ahead and just show you some new interactions. You get into the hot tub here. And I'll go ahead and show you guys how the hot tub works just in case you do not have the, the hot tub there. The kid just went to school, so she left. So she's out. Yay. You guys don't have work? Alright, you're good. Okay. So the fun now does go up on the hot tub before it did not. Huh. And also everything else is good. We also have half walls. Half walls are now in the game. I'll go ahead and pause it here for you so you can see. They are located under the build mode and where the wall tool is, here on the second tab, there's half walls. There is short half wall, which is, I'll go ahead and show you, this way, this one here, the short half wall. That's very, very small. It looks more just like a, you know, maybe a room separation or some sort of gardening, you know, you could use outdoors, it looks like something for maybe the patio or the deck. You could use the very short one. The medium sh short half wall maybe is for a child's area or some sort of separation, maybe in a garden or in the back door, um, maybe in a patio, again, maybe in the backyard. And you can also paint the patterns and the wall trimmings and the different wallpapers on these half walls, just like any other wall. There is medium short half wall there is a medium half wall there is a medium tall half wall and there is the tall half wall so there's all these there's five different levels one two three four and five here it's the same. one two three four and five so it does show you they have little trim it also shows you here you can actually place an item on the half wall so that's really nice so maybe when you do get in your house you start decorating you could actually place items on here which is it's pretty cute you can place little items on there you know in case you're like decorating you can still place things on the wall itself which is like this you can also place items on top of the little counter there so that's nice you can either place items on it okay you can't place big items you can place probably very very small items you can't place plants i mean with the move object tool you may be able to but that's going to be a cheat that it does kind of glitch out your game sometimes but let me see little items okay got that i think i mean very small that can fit there thinking probably something really small can fit there well the bowl fits there that shows you there it shows you a bowl fits there let's see on every single one maybe these trophies would they are locked right now so i can't show you that Let me go ahead and try something small like this even the kid's toy doesn't fit that's really weird okay it does yeah, so something like that fits on the wall. Okay. It's weird that you can only put so many. Well, well they fit. Okay. That's, that's odd. Sometimes it wants to look like it fits and then sometimes it doesn't. So you just have to be zoomed out. I was probably just way too close. So these items do fit. Um, 
me go ahead and check out the plants really quickly again, see if those fit. Maybe I was just too close. No. Plants are too big for that. So things like that won't fit, but there's like little things. So you can put like a little half wall in the kids' room, and you can put little toys up on it. So that'd be cute. So that's one of the new items that it's available. There's also six new wall decals that are available with this update. There's an up arrow, a down arrow, left and a right. And you can also choose the color of the arrow. So, I mean, you can get really creative. There is the male and female wall decal. You can separate room areas. There is also, this door here is not brand new. That's old. There's this new door that's called the seeing glass door. I would think you would use it for retail, um, for the day spa, things like that, because it's see-through. So that's nice, it's a brand new item. There is also this little fencing item that's really good for landscaping. I showed here, there's different colors of the little fence area. And you can do the design tool on there, I know you can. Wait, maybe not on the fence, maybe not after you've already built it, but the fence tool is here. So you can you can do that, you can draw it on, you can draw on any color you like, but once you do draw the color on, you can't change the color like this. Just how it is for fences. Once you draw it on, you cannot change the color. You would have to actually change it manually and then draw it again. Which is fine. So that's that. I just wanted to show you. There is also this new... A couple new options in the gallery. So I think that's all the new items there are. The half walls, the wall decals, the door. The... Awesome, awesome. Now you can lock doors. You can click on here. You can lock the door for everyone. You can lock the door for everyone but employees, which would work really well if you have a retail store and you wanted to have like an employee break room. Or you can lock the door for everyone but yourself. So if it's like your bedroom and you have a roommate and you don't want them to be going into your bedroom, you can go ahead and use that one there. This one's locked door for everyone but your household. So this one you would use mostly for like the front door. You have everyone but your households allowed in. So that's that, or you can use it for like if you have a retail lot and then you have like your house in the back, you can lock that one so no one else can go in but you. And you can have your business and you can have your house in the back. So that's really nice. They also updated it where only one person can walk through the door at once before um, it would glitch out where people would like basically walk through each other. But now only one person can walk through the door at a time. And also in the gallery, I'll go ahead and show you. Maxis has updated in your library. Here's where the gallery opens up. And super, super excited for this. The Sims 4 Spa Day is coming out July 14th. That game pack will be available. So this is the gallery. You can go ahead and add me on the gallery. I have built um, some things. My Let's Play character is here, uh, Michelle England. So you can go ahead and download her if you'd like to. And here is my username there. And The Sims has added about 7, 14, I mean 28 new lots. Some of them are copies of things that were in Oasis Springs and Willow Creek, like the, you know, the museum from Willow Creek here, the, you know, rattlesnake juice bar from the Oasis Springs. So you can go ahead and add those lots back into your game. Say you um, were, you know, you wanted to be really adventurous and you added a bunch of new bars and new venues into your town and you, you know, you ended up not liking it. You wanted to get the original one back, like the original one that was in Oasis Springs originally when you first opened up the neighborhood. Um, before, you actually couldn't find the actual lot. It wasn't, it wasn't uploadable. It wasn't here at all. I didn't see it anywhere. I looked for it. I tried to get this rattlesnake juice bar back into my game and I couldn't find it. So I'm really happy that they uploaded these for you and they're already automatically in your library. So you can go ahead and put them back into your game if you wanted to. There is also some new things for Newcrest. I believe this these first six are for Newcrest. These this next are looks like these were all for Oasis Springs. And then down here looks like they're all for Willow Creek. There's a lot for Willow Creek. Well Willow Creek and Newcrest are about the same type. 
of neighborhood, but it's really nice that they give you a new library. Looks like it's for Newcrest. They give you a new gym for Newcrest. They give you a new bar for Newcrest. They give you a lounge for Newcrest. A nightclub. They also give you a Newcrest park. It's super cute. I actually um, wanted a park in Newcrest myself, so I went in and just downloaded one from the gallery and put it in there. And... You can go ahead and see here. Just let me go back to manage worlds. There is a couple new things they had done as well that I have forgot to mention earlier. So I'll go ahead and show you. When you click on the town, you click here on Newcrest. You can go to view lot types. It shows you exactly like what type of lot is in this town. Residential, library, park, things like that. They also the Oasis Springs. You can click on this. It's going to show you the info for it. It's going to show you what type of bars are here. And you can also preview it. So if you click this little preview button, it will show you right away. These three, you know, are that venue type and you can just put it right into your game. So it's really, really, really convenient for you if you, you know, are just trying to add lots into a game, things like that. So they also, in the Destination World, if you do have the expansion pack for the outdoor, um, you can no longer move into Granite Falls. Before you could move in there, but now you cannot. So we'll go ahead and end it here. I just wanted to show you a quick update on all the new items and all the new things that are getting ready for the spa stuff pack. And I'm so, so excited that you can lock doors and things like that. So we'll just go ahead and stop here. Thanks so much for listening. And I hope you enjoyed this update of The Sims 4.